How are you all? Hope all are doing good job at home. As you can see, we are going to start our maths class. And in this class, we are going to learn three digit numbers reading and writing. So, let's start. Look at this model. Here are some numbers and places. If we know the place of if you know the proper place of the number, we can read the number easily. So, now we are going to read the numbers with the help of this model. Look, here comes one number. Which number is that? Very good. It's 3. And at which place 3 is written? Very nice. 3 is written at units place. Now, here comes another one. Which number is this? Very nice. This is 4. And at which place 4 is written? Very nice. 4 is written as tens place. I hope you know how to read numbers in your previous class. As you have learned these numbers, 2 digit numbers. So, we read this. We read like 43. Now here comes another number. It's 5. Now we have our 3 digit numbers. 1, 2, 3. This is our 3 digit number. And 5 is at 100th place. So we read this number as 543. I am repeating. 543. Okay. Got it? Now, look at another example. Now, there is the next number at unit place. Very good. It's 5 at unit place. And it's only 5. And there is 0 at tens place means this is not a two digit number it's a only single number it's only five and here three is at hundreds place now this is a three digit number there is three at hundreds place zero at tens place and five is at unit place and we read read this number as three hundred and 5 because there is no tens. So, we read it as 305. Okay, got it? Good. Very nice. Now, I am going to tell you the another easy method of reading 3 digit numbers. Here comes one number. Please look at the number carefully. Now, we are going to divide this number into two parts. The first part will be Tens and unit part and the second is hundreds, hundreds part. So we are going to divide into two parts and we have divided it into two parts. Tens and units group and hundreds group. Now there, there is four in hundreds group and there is 68 at tens and units group. So we read the number easily. Now this number will be 468. It's so easy, so easy to read the number. Isn't it easy? Good. It's very easy to read this number. Now, here comes another one. Look at this number carefully. In, the, in this number, we are going to make two parts. First part is tens and unit, and second one is hundred. So, in this number, there is 3 in hundreds group and 50 in tens and units group and there is no unit. So, we read this number as 350. Got it? Good. Now, here comes next one. Look at this number very carefully. We are going to make two parts of this number. First is Tens and units row and second one is hundreds row. So we read it as 400 because there is no tens and no unit. So we read it as only 400. Got it? Very good. 
now we are going to make three digit numbers look look at this figure here is a triangle and on this triangle there are some digits there there is one four and five these are the digits on the triangle now we are going to make three digit numbers by using the same digits first we we will take one at hundreds place four at tens place and five at units place and the number will be 145 now we will make another number by changing the place of the given digits 1 is at hundreds place 5 is at tens place and 4 is at units place and the number is 154 by changing the place places of the numbers we are going to make more and more three digit numbers the next one is now we are taking four is at hundreds place one is at tens place and five is at units place and the number is 415 and the next number is 451 by changing the places of tens and units we got the number 451 now the next number we, we are going to take 5 at hundreds place 4 at tens place and 1 at units place and the number is 541 and the another number is 514 with the help of these three digits we have made six numbers of three digits let's try another example of this type look at this triangle there are three digits on the triangle 2 0 and 3 these are the digits on the triangle now we are going to make three digit numbers from the given digits first i will put two two at the hundreds place zero at tens place and three at units place and the number is 203 because there is no tens so it 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 is read at 203 and the next number is two at hundreds place 3 at tens place and 0 at units place. So, this number is 230. And the next number is 3 at hundreds place, 2 at tens place and 0 at units place. And the number is 320. Now, the next number. 3 is at hundreds place, 0 is at tens place and 2 is at units place and the number is 302. We made 4 numbers with the help of these digits and we, we don't take 0 at hundreds place because it will be 2 digit number. Look here, when we take 0 at hundreds place, 3 at tens place and 2 at units place, it will be only 32. It's not a 3 digit number. So, we don't take 0 at hundreds place. Okay, got it? You have to complete this assignment. In this first assignment, you have to fill the proper numbers in the empty boxes and the another is you have to make three digit numbers from the given digits okay got it thank you